All right, so daily bias, all right? So first things first, open up Forex Factory. Okay, boom, boom, all right. Unemployment claims, Philly Fed Manufacturing Index. I don't really care too much about this because this comes out at the same time as unemployment claims every single time. Unemployment claims gives us a bearish bias. Why? Because less than forecast is good for currency. What was it? Less than the forecast, good for currency, bad for S&P. Okay, bearish bias. All right, so with that being said, we have boom, a high right here in the 15 minute. We took out these lows, so we don't care about that anymore. We just took out these lows. We have a high right here in the 15 minute, high right here in the 15 minute. I would not be surprised if we come up above this high and then get some action to the downside. However, something to know is the strong ass reaction that we have off of this, okay? Um, so that is definitely something to know. We had a strong ass reaction of this liquidity sweep. And if we, if we close above this, then, you know, that could maybe sway my bias right now. Right now, news bias, bearish, um, but really right now I'm kind of like, okay, if it wants to make something happen off of this and off of this as like a, you know, like an actual valid liquidity sweep, then we could see something potential. Uh, potentially happening but we still have plenty of time until market opens and this candle closes we have like 11 minutes so um that's pretty much it for now if we go in the one hour we're bearish which is in tune with our news bias okay um we're kind of playing within this stupid ass range right now ideally we see these highs get blown out because we literally have one unprotected high two unprotected high three unprotected high four under unprotected high and five un unprotected high this is liquidity 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 hopefully that will be taken out and fill in this fair value gap i forget where i marked it i think it was on the daily yeah um but i mean bullish bullish <laughs> jesus boogie uh bullish market has been strong so far i mean right we have We have uh, this monthly low right here, right? That we are obviously using as just like a magnet to draw price into. So if it doesn't want to come up here, who cares? Um, this is right our main area of interest. So yeah, that's, that's about it for now. Um, we'll see how this candle closes, what it wants to do off this um, off this area, we can also go ahead and just mark out these ones lower. Um, these are relatively the same area, so if this gets swept, this will likely get swept as well. Um, and then I'll just go ahead and put this one on too. Perfect. All right, so boom, bearish bias with, um, yeah, we have high right here, high right here, another high all the way up here. Um, ideally we sweep like this high or this high so we can take shorts all the way down to boom, boom, and then even boom. Okay, but we'll see what market gives us. All right, that's kind of it for now. All right, market just opened, did a bullshit ass sweep of these one minute highs. We'll see where it wants to go. All right. It uh, going back to what we previously said, it closed below here and below here, so both of these are kind of invalid at this point. Um, I'll leave this one on just for now. We have a one hour order block right here that I marked out before I started the recording, but boom, one hour order block right here, okay. We might fill it, we might not. Um, I do still want to have a bearish bias today, but like I said, that could change. Um, but I mean, yeah, hopefully we can climb up and take out some of these highs. That would be ideal. All right, so we just hit that one hour order block. Hit the one hour order block. We're just chilling right now. Um, right, you can see the accumulation in here before the expansive move up. Um, this is on the lower time frame, so.
And honestly, what would be what would be best for like longs would be like push all the way into this order block, hit the base of it, and sweep this liquidity as well. Right? Because this is just the wick of the order block, right? This is the base is what we like is almost like, you know, boom, we're ready to go if it hits the base. Um, that's just like what I would want. Yeah, like I wouldn't want to take a buy off a of breaker structure to the upside yet. Like it like I need to see more price action because I'm still ideally bearish, but if we come all the way down here, I'll probably flip bullish. Alright, so close above this high. Me personally, I still can't be I don't I'm not bullish yet. Like yeah, if it wants to push up, I'm fine with that. It, like just make it sweep these highs and then short off of that i just rather play it safe than take like a counter trend buy off of like a bullshit type of break of structure like this you know but while we're at it we can mark this just in case Took out this five minute high. We still have this 15 minute and this 15 minute high. We're above equilibrium as well. This one's kind of iffy, bro. Because look, we have this five minute high that we just, you know, rejected off of. But then we also have a five minute order block. I kind of like this order block, I'm not going to lie. We'll see what it does off this. I don't know. To me, this is just like a violent ass close. Like, we can't short off this, you know? Like, we would have been filled right here. And that just ain't right. <clears throat> Not taking anything yet. That close was definitely not enough for me to get in. Definitely not enough. That shit is indecisive. If we close well on this, see, then it's doing that bullshit. If we close well on this, I'll, I would like to go long, but as of now, like, it's not showing much. Okay, I'll let you guys know, though. That's not good enough for me. Still not good enough. I want, like, confirmation, right? It's, it's battling between here right now. We're holding the base of the order block though, which is a really good sign, but like these wicks, are, that ain't that ain't enough. That ain't enough. Definitely ain't enough. If it closes like this, I'll buy it. But if it does some bullshit like this, then no go. But right now it looks like we'll end up getting a buy. Alright, I'm in, I I bought. I went long. I got filled like, I got filled like right here. Solid. If we get a bullish close on the five minute, that would be, that would be so clutch. Um, because right now, we, we didn't even get a break of structure on the one minute. This was kind of a risky entry. I mean, we had this, but then we broke structure to the downside again, right? So, this is kind of in hopes that this order block on the five minute holds. We've got like three minutes left on this five minute candle, so we'll see. What it wants to do. Okay, so a decent five minute close, okay? We, we tapped into the order block and 
give a nice little five minute close here. We'll see if it wants to come up and take out this 15 minute high. <clears throat> okay. Um, yeah, that's kind of all we're looking at. Oh, go back. Go back to what you were doing. <laughs> go back to what you were doing. Hold on. <laughs> go back to what you were doing. Whoa, go back. Bitch, go back. Go, go back. Do what you were about to do. Do what you want to do. Do what you want to do. You know what you're supposed to do. Whoa. Cool it. Cool it. Cool it, bitch. Bye -bye. Close half your position. Good shit, baby. Good shit. Close half your position. Move your stop loss to break even. Let's go. Another dub ski. Why are we hella good at this? Because me personally, secured, oh my god, secured 3k in profit and up, like, up, up another 3k. Yo. Yo. Should we turn chat on real quick? Should, should we see if this shit is a, a scam? Yeah. Let me know. Let me know. Let me know. Because we do this shit every damn day. Let me know. <laughs> and let's turn this bullshit ass house off. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Let me turn some damn good ass music on. It said stop scamming. Shit. My B. My B. My B. <clears throat> Yo, what? I don't want to hear this shit right now. My molly off white like cocaine, yeah for real Got fangs, yeah, don't vamp, bitch, O-P-I-U-M any, uh, any TikTok comment that says I don't do this, please refer to the live trade section of the YouTube channel um, I think it would be very beneficial for you If you learn a thing or two, because There's there's no there's no cap in this rap bro like i post every shit bro <laughs> look at my motherfucking neck bitch look at my motherfucking neck bitch half y'all don't even got this shit in your bank not talking about y'all but i'm talking about the bitch ass haters thank you to my drugs thank you to my drugs i did it but the other day i know rich as fuck Keep this shit up. Yo, where was that one Brazilian dude that said he was he was gonna he was gonna full port? Oh my god. Who's where is the Brazilian dude? You bro, nah, how much did you make? How about you better buy lifetime, bro, on everything? You're up 40k? 40k? Buy lifetime, bro. Buy lifetime if you want to keep making 40k. Yeah, no, I know, I know, I know, I know. You full p Jesus, why'd you full port, bro? I'm hella close to getting stopped out at break even. Oh, 
Alright, I'm out now. <clears throat> Solid little day. Three bands profit. And, and our bearish bias from this trade would have worked out too. Closure below. Or we don't know like for sure yet, but like this would be our first take profit down here. You shorted? Good shit. Yeah. So like either way you played this, you're getting paid. You took that short? Nice. I solid. Um we made money. Uh I don't really know what else to say. We we did our shit. <laughs>